The newer technologies are um, mostly molecular based. Um, they are either singleplex or multiplex uh, PCR um, assays, or if they're not PCR, they're other uh, DNA amplification techniques. So there um, <coughs> are uh, uh, assays that uh, target uh, specific organisms like Staphylococci, so the gene expert um, uh, Staph uh, SR uh, assay. Uh, can differentiate uh, methicillin susceptible from methicillin resistant Staph aureus from non Staph aureus isolates and do that in approximately an hour directly out of a positive blood culture bottle. Uh, there are also new uh, assays uh, from uh, Biofire, uh, which is called the BCID uh, assay, which has 27. Uh, different targets, uh, m multiple gram-positive targets, gram-negative targets, and uh, also um, two uh, uh, candidate uh, targets, several candidate targets, um, and um, can detect um, uh, uh, the KPC carbapenemase. Uh, and those results uh, are also direct from a positive blood culture and will uh, uh, be positive, be, you'll get your results within um, uh, about one hour. Uh, there's a similar technology, uh, similar in concept at least, from um, uh, uh, Luminex, it's called the Veragene. Uh, that has 30 targets, uh, uh, again, gram-positive targets, gram-negative targets, um, uh, and uh, that um, uh, technology uh, can provide uh, uh, results for six different resistance uh, genes for gram negatives, uh, the CTXM, ESBL, um, uh, and the KPC, and other uh, carbapenemases, and it also for gram positives uh, detects the MECA gene uh, and also the uh, VAN A and B genes uh, that confer resistance to vancomycin in enterococci. So, um, uh, not yet uh, FDA approved, but uh, approval expected uh, for a new um, uh, a similar in concept system from uh, Genmark, uh, and that, uh, that system uh, will have uh, somewhere in the range of 65 to 70 different targets, so many more uh, uh, bacterial uh, strains uh, five uh, uh, or more, I, I think it's even more fungal strains, including um, uh, cryptococci um, and fusarium. Uh, so uh, that system uh, will, be, um, uh, will be very interesting when it becomes available. And there's yet one additional uh, a system that uh, is uh, not molecular, that is uh, growth-based. It's, it's called the Accelerate Pheno, and the Accelerate Pheno uh, detects um, eight gram-positive organisms, eight gram-negative organisms, um, uh, uh, five candida species, um, and provides um, uh, a phenotypic susceptibility result, so a f a essentially a full range of susceptibility results. And it does the identification in approximately uh, an hour and a half and provides the susceptibility results in uh, about seven hours.